Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, brothers and sisters, Jum'ah Mubarak, alhamdulillah, I am in the blessed masjid of Al-Aqsa and today we pray Jum'ah Salah here, alhamdulillah, it was amazing atmosphere, the masjid was full, it was packed, alhamdulillah, what an amazing uh, uh, experience, now I am about to uh, donate the, uh, the Lilla money that you guys have donated here, I'm about to put it inside the masjid donation box. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept your donation. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala put barakah in your risk and in your rosy and your sustenance. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant you all the opportunity, the ability to visit these blessed lands time and time again. Ameen. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. اللهم حبب المسجد الأقصى اللهم 
متحرر المسجد الأقصى اللهم انسر الإسلام والمستضعفين في كل مكان يا رب العالمين يا الله يا الله we have gathered here in the third holiest place on the face of this entire earth يا الله we are in your house يا الله we are in the place where you invited نبي كريم صلى الله عليه وسلم يا الله we are in the blessed lands يا الله we are in the lands where where a person prays one salah يا الله he is rewarded by up to 500 rewards يا الله we have gathered here after completing the holy Quran يا الله يا الله يا الله forgive each and every single one of us يا الله forgive our sins يا الله forgive our shortcomings يا الله forgive our mistakes يا الله we are humans يا الله we commit sin يا الله يا الله we commit sin on a daily basis يا الله we are humans we are forgetful يا الله we are humans we are ignorant but يا الله you are Rahman يا الله you are Rahim يا الله you are the most merciful you are the most forgiving يا الله يا الله our trip will be a failure يا الله our journey here to the blessed lands of Al-Aqsa will be a failure if we return back home without getting our sins forgiven يا الله يا الله before we drop our hands هم سبك قناعكم ما فرمها يا الله before this dua complete يا الله forgive each and every single one of us يا الله let us leave the blessed lands just like a newborn baby is born without any sins on their shoulders يا الله forgive our family members يا الله forgive our parents يا الله forgive our siblings يا الله forgive our children يا الله forgive all of those that have asked me to make dua for them يا الله forgive all of those who have left this world Ya Allah, forgive all of those who have left this world. Ya Allah, from our parents, from our friends, from our loved ones, from our dear ones. Ya Allah, forgive each and every single one of them. Ya Allah, those from amongst us, those who are in this gathering and who have raised their hands. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, if they have white hairs on their faces. Ya Allah, they have grew up in your beautiful religion of Islam. Ya Allah, through their innocence, Ya Allah, forgive our sins. Ya Allah, those from amongst us who have lost parents, family members. Ya Allah, grant them Jannah to fill those. Ya Allah, grant them the highest ranks in paradise. Ya Allah, whatever sadaqat we have tried to do for them on this journey, Ya Allah, accept it from us. Ya Allah, this Quran recitation that we have completed, Ya Allah, accept it from us. Ya Allah, make it a means of their entry and our entry into Jannah to fill those. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, Ya Allah, let us leave this world with the kalima, everyone. La ilaha illallah Muhammadur Rasulullah Continuously repeating on our tongues Ya Allah save us from the fire of Jahannam Ya Allah save us from the punishment of the grave Ya Allah, Ya Allah save us from Dajjal Ya Allah save us from the waswasa of Shaitan Ya Allah those from amongst us whose parents are still alive Ya Allah grant them a long and a healthy life Ya Allah grant them a life of siha and afiyah Ya Allah grant us all the ability to serve our parents Ya Allah, to to do the khidma of our parents. Ya Allah, the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said it beautifully in a narration. He says that beneath the feet of our mothers is paradise. Our fathers are the key to paradise. Ya Allah, grant us this entry into paradise. Ya Allah, grant us this entry into paradise. And Ya Allah, let us take our parents with us in paradise. Ya Allah, those from amongst us who are bimar, Ya Allah, grant them a full and a swift recovery. Ya Allah, grant them mukammal shifa. Ya Allah, grant them such a recovery that the illness never returns again. Ya Allah, save us all from cancer. Ya Allah, save us all from mental health. Ya Allah, save us all from depression. Ya Allah, always give us good ability so that we may never ever become dependent on anybody else. Ya Allah, always keep us, always keep us in good health. Ya Allah. ya Allah, fill our hearts with the love of Iman. Ya Allah, fill our hearts with the love of Islam. Ya Allah, fill our hearts with the love of the Quran. Ya Allah, on occasions like this, all of the du'as that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam made in terms of goodness, Ya Allah, grant us all of those du'as. Ya Allah, on occasions like this, all of the du'as that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam asked protection from, Ya Allah, protect us from all of those things. Ya Allah, protect us from cancer. Ya Allah, cancer is a very deadly disease. 
Ya Allah, so many of our family members have passed away because of this disease. Ya Allah, grant them the status of a martyr. Ya Allah, grant them the status of a shaheed. Ya Allah, those from us and our family members who are suffering from this very deadly disease. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, grant them siha and afia. Ya Allah, grant them siha and afia. Ya Allah, grant them the best of endings. Ya Allah, all of those who are currently in a bad situation. Ya Allah, all of those who are going through a tough time in their life from this gathering and from our family members. Members. Ya Allah, remove the stress from our lives. Ya Allah, remove the stress from our lives. Ya Allah, you have said it beautifully in the Quran. Indeed, after difficulty, there will always be ease. Ya Allah, we have been through many days of difficulties. Ya Allah, we have been through many days of difficulties. Ya Allah, we are humans. Ya Allah, we are weak. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, reward us for our patience. But Ya Allah, grant us days of goodness. Ya Allah, grant us days of happiness. Ya Allah, those from amongst us who are not married and are looking to get married, Ya Allah, make it easy for them to find a pious and a righteous spouse. Ya Allah, those who are married and don't have children, Ya Allah, bless them with pious offspring. Ya Allah, those who are married and have children, Ya Allah, make our children a cool to our eyes. Ya Allah, make our children a coolness to our eyes. Ya Allah, make our children hafid of the Quran. Ya Allah, make them alim of the deen. Ya Allah, make them da'i in Allah. But most importantly, keep us and our children, our parents, our family members, our lineages on the straight path. Ya Allah, keep us on the path which, which was led by Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Ya Allah, save us from walking on that path which is led by shaitan. Ya Allah, save us from going astray. Ya Allah, save us from the wrong path. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, all of those who, Ya Allah, all of those who are, who are in debt, Ya Allah, make it easy for them to fulfill this debt. Ya Allah, we are going to go back to our hometowns. Ya Allah, we know the state of our cities and our villages. Ya Allah, there's too many drugs going on. Ya Allah, there's too much music. Ya Allah, there's too much zina going on. Ya Allah, save us from all of these sins. Ya Allah, those who are indulged in these crimes, those who are indulged in these sins, Ya Allah, I know it is hard, but Ya Allah, grant them, grant them the ability to leave this path, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, grant them the ability to leave this path, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, fill their hearts with the love of Islam. Ya Allah, everything that I have asked for, Ya Allah, grant us all those things. Ya Allah, everything I should have asked for and I haven't asked for, Ya Allah, grant us all those things. Ya Allah, grant us many times that we can visit these blessed lands of Al-Aqsa. Ya Allah, let us see the day that Palestine will be free. Ya Allah, let us see the day that Masjid Al-Aqsa will be in the hands of the Muslims. Ya Allah, all of those who are doing the oppression, Ya Allah, if Hidayah isn't written for them, then Ya Allah, start their punishment in this world. Ya Allah, all of those that are oppressed, Ya Allah, make it. Ya Allah, make it easy for them. Ya Allah, very shortly, uh, we are going to be making our own, own du'as. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, Ya Allah, accept it from us. Ya Allah, whatever we ask from you, grant us it. Ya Allah, fulfill our hajat and our wishes and our desires. Ya Allah, don't reject this du'a. Ya Allah, one day we are going to have to leave this world. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, don't call us at a time when you are angry with us. Ya Allah, don't call us at a time when we are busy committing a sin. Ya Allah, don't call us at a time when you are displeased with us. Ya Allah, but rather call us at a time when you are happy with us. Ya Allah, call us at a time when you are pleased with us. Ya Allah, call us at a time when we are busy in your worship. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, be happy with us. Ya Allah, be pleased with us and shower your rahmah and your mercy upon each and every single one of us. Wa sallillahu ta'ala ala khayri khalqihi muhammadin wa ala alihi wa ashabihi ajma'in.